having you here in this video i'll be making goat meat pepper soup nigerian goat meat pepper soup so i will leave a list of all these ingredients in the description box the description box is just below this video click on the see more text and you will see a list of all these ingredients and more i'll be using for this special goat meat recipe so let's get cooking first I pour in the washed goat meat into a pot. It's good to note that this is the male goat. The male goat cooks faster than the female goat and is sweeter than the female goat. In here, I have the offals and the goat meat proper. So let's go ahead and season this. I pour in blended onions. I'll break in two seasoning cubes. This will probably be the only seasoning cubes I'll be using for this. I'll use natural spices. I'll add in a little salt. And I'll stir this to combine properly. I always say that your seasoning and your salt should be proportional to the quantity of food you're cooking. If you're not sure, you add a little per time and adjust as you cook along. This is just pepper soup, so it doesn't need a lot of seasoning or salt. I wouldn't be adding water to this. I will allow it to produce its own juice before adding water to it. I will cover and allow it to steam before getting back to it. People have asked me the spices I use for my pepper soup, and I will show you guys quickly. In here, I have ehuru. This ehuru has been... The back has been removed. This is the one with the back. When roasted, you can easily remove the back. So this is the one we'll be using. And we'll be using three of this. Then we'll have Oziza seeds. These seeds are very nice for your pepper soup and most of your Nigerian soups. Then I have ginger. And I have garlic. I also have onions. And I have the yellow scent pepper. This pepper is very nice for your pepper soup. And the normal peppers, the scotch bonnet peppers. I also have habanero peppers here. I like these peppers because it will give color to your pepper soup. Your pepper soup wouldn't just be looking all white. It's not as spicy as this. So I have much of it here. And I also have otaz leaves. And scent leaves you can use either or both of these leaves they are very nice for your pepper soups so let's go ahead and grind this ones i add in the peppers to the blender please add as much pepper as you can bear we're adding onion Adding the Oziza seeds, and I'll be using three ehuru for this. The ginger and the garlic. I'll add in water. And I'll blend it very smoothly. Next, I cut the veggies into tiny strips. I've washed this properly. There is no sand or dirt in it. This is a very quick recipe. Once your ingredients are prepped, you are ready in 20 minutes. Five minutes later, and this has simmered well enough. You can see it generated its own water. I'm going to give it a stir. Remember I mentioned that this is male goat, and this species doesn't take time to cook at all. We are going to be adding all the blended ingredients. Here comes in the blended ingredients, the habanero peppers, garlic, ginger, oziza, and all of them. I'll also add in the blended crayfish. Now stir to combine properly. Please, if you're using a protein that is tougher to cook, allow the meat to get a little bit tender before you add in this blended ingredients. I'll cover this and allow it to cook for 10 more minutes. I'll be enjoying this pepper soup with rice 
the rice is already here ready waiting for the pepper soup to get ready what do you normally enjoy your pepper soup with a core agidi rice or what please let me know in the comment section as we wait for this to cook this has been boiling for 10 to 15 minutes now look at this delicious goodness i will stay it the meat has cooked tender enough i told you is the male goat and it's faster and easier to cook than the female goat i'll go ahead and check for the salt and the seasoning i need to adjust a little salt and i'll mix them all in please like this video also subscribe to my channel if you've not done so it will help me a lot thank you very much next i'll be adding in the veggies the otazi and the scent leaf the ingredients used for this pepper soup are all natural and medicinal you can go ahead and try them you can easily get them in the market so i'll stir this in how do you like the water of your pepper soup do you want it too much more than the meat or the meat more than the water mine is just at the same level with the meat i'll stir properly for the leaves to combine I'll cover and cook for two more minutes two minutes later wow I'll give it the final stir and our pepper soup is declared ready you can serve this to your visitors is a quick recipe once you have your ingredients within 20 minutes you are ready let's go ahead and serve this The goat meat pepper soup is served. I'll be having mine with white rice and fried plantain. Thank you for watching and see you in my next video.